Hello and welcome to the, my Yu-Gi-Oh channel. So today we're looking at a new V-Jump promo. It's called Stay Sailor Romarin. It's a light attribute plant type tuna monster. It's a level four with 1,600 attack and 300 defense. You can only use each of this card's names first and second effects at once per turn. One as a quick effect, you can target one face up monster you control. Send one plant monster you control to the graveyard, accept that target. And if you do the next time that target would be destroyed by battle card effect, this turn, it is not destroyed. Two, if this card is sent to the graveyard by a card effect, you can send one level five or lower plant monster from your deck or extra deck to the graveyard. This is quite flexible for what plants like to do. Remember with plant synchro monsters, it was a nightmare to deal with within um, the uh, synchro generation. So that was Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds. You had so many support cards. You've got Lone Flyer Bo Blossom. You had Dandelion. You Spore, you've got Glow Up Bulb, and this is one of those new Nightmare cards which is going to just add to that, and it's just going to be a little bit too powerful, I think. It does provide your monster with a level of protection from a card effect or destruction by battle, and it can be responded during either turn. And this effect is, even though it's only once per turn, being able to get rid of a plant directly from your deck to your graveyard means you can set up with things like Spore or Glow Up Bulb, as I said. And those can then be recovered later on either by their own effect or by various other recovery effects and then used for Synchro Summoning. By doing this, it makes deck a lot more consistent. Um, you don't have to run so many search cards. You don't have to overly thin your deck. And it's definitely something you need to be running maybe two or three of. The secondary effect is if your opponent is stupid enough to attack to destroy this by a card effect, I don't know why you would. 1600 isn't so powerful that you can't actually just get over it already. Then they, you can get rid of another plant type monster from your deck or extra deck, uh, which can then be used potentially in the future, either to be revived or to be used for synchro summoning into something much better. It being a level four is also quite decent because it can go into very easy uh, even numbers, whereas a lot of some of the odd number, odd level monsters are a bit trickier to get into those pure uh, level 8 monsters. So that also provides more flexibility to how the deck wants to play.